Trick or treat. Trick or treat. I don't understand what's happening. <laughs> Thank you. Oh. Trick or treat. Trick or treat. Trick or treat. Trick or treat. Welcome. Are you looking for something good to eat? Tell us your lives. Here you go. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Treat. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Bailey. <laughs> That's not how the game works. <laughs> Trick or treat. Okay, back up. It's about back up. Trick or treat. We gotta get. Okay, trick. Trick or treat. You gotta tell me a joke. Like, I can't just. You're those creepy high school kids <laughs> that feel like it's still okay to dress up, but it's not. If you're gonna come, you gotta like review something. Why is six just... scared of seven? Why? It's seven, eight, nine. Oh, trick oh. or treat. Um, oh, I gotta find something to do. Be careful, kid, it's sharp. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh my gosh. Oh, 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 this is amazing. Uh, trick or treat. Tell me who you are first. I mean, I know Pope, Prancer. Oh, Prancer. Okay, very nice. Batman. Who are you, Batman? Okay. Um, this is this is awesome. Well, go forth and good luck. Trigger, trigger treat. Trigger treat. Trigger treat. Treat. Trigger treat. Am I supposed to take something? Okay. Am I supposed to give you something? Trick or treat. You have to give me a joke, though. Oh. What did the farmer say when he couldn't find his tractor? Where's my tractor? Hey, Matt, it's Katie. I don't know about this. Trick or treat. I got nothing. Check it out. Hold on. <laughs> Trick or treat. What was wrong with you guys? Hold the bucket. No, oh, okay. This is a caramello bite that I have a very dangerous addiction to. There you go. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. You, Thank you. you Thank guys you. are welcome. You're wonderful kids. <laughs> Trick or treat. Oh. oh. Trick or treat. Trick or treat. Is it legit? You give us. Oh, we give you trigger a trick or treat. Trigger treat. God, that's awesome. <laughs> We have Gracie Stratman here, and she's going to try and bob for apples. Do you have any excitement about this? No. Okay, go. <laughs> Is there anything that you're excited for during Halloween? I can't grab them. <laughs> What was your favorite part about bobbing for apples? I like apples. Did you have any regrets going into it? Participating. Our new contestant is Eli Bray. How's it going? Ready, set, go. <laughs> hey, <God. laughs> what was your favorite part about bobbing for apples? Almost drowning. Is there a specific strategy that you use? 
I opened my mouth, my mouth as wide as I could and just like tried biting on the side of the of the tub. This is Carson Eats. Carson, say hi. How's it going? All right, you have 45 seconds to get as many apples as you can. The record is currently held by Eli Bray for five apples. One, two, three, go. All right, that's one. Four apples. Five apples. And time. How do you think you did? Uh, okay. I got lots of water in my ear. Yeah. Um, what was your main strategy going into this? Uh, put it on the wall and bite. All right, Carson won. Yeah. So here's your gift bucket. Yay. I'm Isabel. I'm a Grusa. I'm Kirsten. And I'm here with... I'm Big Ava. And I'm Little Ava. Uh, Anthony Steele. Maya. And Brayden. I'm Ryan. I'm Eli. My name is Carson. I'm Dylan. And I'm going to be asking them some spooky Halloween questions. <laughs> what are your top three favorite candy options to get while trick-or-treating. Um, I love Hershey Kisses. I like to suck on them. I like Nerd Coaster. Those are my favorite. And then I'm going to say Sour Patch Kids. Once I got a hot dog, I know that's not candy, but it was pretty good. And, um, what? Kit Kats or Reese's. And Twizzlers, Skittles, and Blow Pops. Twix, blow pops, and no, I'm just saying, it's like the purple skills. <laughs> Snickers is definitely one. Butterfingers is probably two. Um, I have to think about the third one. I don't know. I'm gonna say the just the Ghirardelli chocolate because I know it's not Halloween candy, but it's really good chocolate. I love Sour Patch Kids, Snickers, and sometimes they give me warheads and I love them as well, so I'll eat those. Would you rather work in a haunted house scaring people or go through a house being scared? I feel like I would enjoy working in a haunted house to scare people because I feel like I move kind of weird so I feel like they would get scared of me, so. <laughs> <laughs> well, I would want to be scared because I'm not, I don't think I'd be good at scaring people and it's fun to be scared. I would have to say work at a haunted house and scare people because I feel like that would be oddly enough kind of fun. I love getting scared so I'd probably say like go to a haunted house but I saw this one horror movie where like they went to a haunted house and like everyone got killed so that's always in the back of my mind. But I'd What was your favorite Halloween costume you wore as a kid? Definitely a ninja because I looked cool. I had a samurai sword. I was a trash man and my sister and brother was a trash bag. So that was fun. <laughs> Probably Batman. I'm going to have to say either Buzz or Woody because for a solid five years I alternated between those two costumes. What is your weapon of choice for a zombie apocalypse? A fire extinguisher, a baseball bat, an axe, or a stand? Okay. I'm going with the baseball bat. I spent the most time with the baseball bat in my hand. An axe? Just because I'm I could kill something? <laughs> I'm going with the baseball bat. Definitely a baseball bat. Okay. Thank you for your time. Yeah, ready? Happy Halloween, UHS, from me to you.